looking for a sleek and eye-catching motorboat with luxurious accommodation, plenty of sunbathing space, powerful engines for an obscene top speed, full air conditioning and all the latest gadgets, then we have just the thing. Plymouth-based Princess Motiarts remains one of Britain's leading powerboat builders, producing fast, well-made hulls with top quality furniture and robust engineering. This fine example of a V55 is one of its greyhounds. As you can see when this boat came out for our rigorous checks, the hull is a very deep V, giving superb sea handling. We touched 37 knots during our delivery trip and there was still some grunt in reserve. Originally designed for the MED, the V55 features a vast cockpit. This one protected by a nearly new, full-length cover that is easy to convert into a bimini. The sections are stored away in the lazarette. For entertaining or just chilling out, there is a convenient wet bar with a cooker, a large fridge and, essential for the balmy summer we've been promised, an ice maker. The cockpit decks and bathing platform are all teak laid and, inside the spacious tender garage, a hydraulically operated lazarette gives access ashore when moored stern too in typical med fashion. The helm station is to starboard, featuring power-assisted steering with an autopilot, rain rain instruments and a pop-up 10.4-inch colour radar, plotter and GPS. Opening the mirrored companionway door, we enter the main saloon with its navy blue leather upholstery and princess trademark curves. The galley is to port and, cleverly disguised beneath the gloss cherry woodwork, there is a three-ring ceramic hob and a sink. Underneath is a combination microwave and to the left is a large refrigerator with a freezer compartment. Storage throughout is ample. Moving forwards, the spacious full-width owner suite is in the bow, with a large island double berth, main sockets and repeat controls for the air conditioning. This compartment has a dedicated shower and toilet compartment to starboard, where the cherry wood and navy blue theme is continued. Decor is complemented by a smoked acrylic shower screen and a circular teak shower grill. Moving back aft again, there are two guest cabins, both with twin single berths, but with an infill in the port cabin to convert to a double. The second loo and shower compartment is to port, beside the companionway, and can be accessed from the main saloon and also from the port guest cabin. An entertainment centre is next to the galley, offering a CD stereo system, a TV and a DVD player, all connected to a network of carefully placed speakers. The saloon is very light and airy, thanks to several overhead hatches and adjustable blinds, that could be sealed up tight for privacy and air-conditioned comfort. Back in the cockpit, the twin MAN 800 horsepower diesels on shaft drives are beneath the cockpit floor and can hurl this high performance boat along at speeds of up to 40 knots. They have each logged a healthy 1064 hours with a full service history. Behind the engine room is a generous lazarette, home to the battery banks, fender rack and Onan 9.5 kilowatt generator. There is also clear access to the mechanism for the passerelle for routine servicing. Built in 2001, this was the last ever Princess V55 produced before the design was superseded, but she has been well looked after by her two previous owners.